Hello. We're going to talk about Tanru. Alright, I have here some plisa, which means apples. These are apples, and these are also apples. Plisa. What there's a the difference between these two kinds of plisa? These plisa are hunre, and these plisa are shirino, green and red. All right, so we can, you can't see it, but every gizmo and every briefla comes with tanru glue on it from the, from the briefla factory. All right, it has, it has tanru glue on either side of it. And whenever it comes in contact with another gizmo or with another briefla, they stick together and form a tanru. So if you put these next to each other, boop, you get a tonru. The whole tonru is something, it's all a plisa. And this part of the tonru is, um, describes what kind of plisa it is. It's an apple that's related to something hunre, that's related to something red. In this case, it's related to it by actually being red itself. So we could put a jet in here. This that which would that's an and for Tanru and that's that would say explicitly this is red and an apple. Hunra Je please. But you don't have to put the and you can just say Shrino please. Or you can say Shrino Je please. No, not always if you put together tanru is it going to mean that both it's both the things. For instance, here we have some pens. Pen be pen. Now these are green pens, so you can call them Shrino pen be. But suppose we have both of them and we want to tell them apart. Well they're both Shrino. Here's over here we have some Narju Nimra, some orange citruses. Alright, so let's take the pens and let's put one over here by the Nimra and let's put one over here by the red apples. Now, this pen we can call the Hunre pen B. It doesn't mean that it's a red pen, it's a green pen, but it can be the Hunre pen B because something distinctive about it is that it's related to something red. It's, it's the one that's near the apples. And we can take this pen B and we can call it the Narju pen B, the orange pen, because it's over here by these orange things. So that's another thing that Tanru can mean. Um, that's just the most very basic thing to know about Tanru. There's a lot of stuff about Tanru. And we'll get into that later. Shoho.